So again, welcome back to Ask Laurel. And if your business is really new, um, getting lines of credit is going to require a business plan. So I have a very quick four hour process. We'll talk you through how to get enough of a business plan because you're gonna need strategies. You're gonna need to show the, either the banks or a financial institute, whether even if it's 0% credit cards, you're gonna have to show that you actually have rev, revenue producing plan. How are you gonna make sales? How's the money gonna come in? How are you gonna use the money? So a couple things I would say, 0% credit cards are free, right? Lines of credit are gonna cost you money and Sharks investors are going to cost you money. So I, there's a lot of ways to fund the startup of your company. One that everyone overlooks. And I had a call even this morning saying, why aren't you just selling yourself? So if you can't make the first sale on your own and you're waiting for some money to move you along as an investor, I'm thinking, well, why aren't you making any money right now? You have plenty of time. You could go make the money on your own. You just don't want to. You think money's going to magically make something happen. It's not. It's your daily behavior your sales process that's going to make the money, which then is going to give you bigger lines of credit. The other way that I would do, I mean, I got lots of answers to this. So zero lines of, uh, zero down credit cards, lines of credit backed by business plans, getting an investor, which is getting a shark, uh, partnering with the shark uh, for their access and partnering with credit. It's another thing that a lot of people do in the real estate space is how do you partner with somebody else's credit? So, you know, a lot of people say, well, I can't get into the real estate because I had a foreclosure or bankruptcy or whatever you have. You can, you partner with credit. I call it OPC, right? You can use other people's IRAs. So there's a lot of ways to get money. The real question is, do you have a business plan worthy of the money? That's where the real problem typically is in new startups.